This manhunt incited fear throughout the Adirondacks. Despite this large-scale manhunt, Garrow evaded capture. On August 5th, when temperatures began to drop, search parties picked up a pattern in Garrow's movement after a few positive sightings. On August 6th, he was spotted at a speculator gas station. And then on August 7th, authorities found out Garrow visited his sister's home in Witherby. After keeping an eye on the house, on August 9th, authorities followed Garrow's nephew to a nearby thicket where Garrow was hiding. Bloodhounds were used to drive him out, and Garrow ignored commands to surrender. Garrow's capture on August 9th ended the manhunt, but his story didn't end there. During the trial for the murder of Domblowski, Garrow told his defense team that he also murdered Hawk and Pete.